It's a good idea to keep a variety of sewing machine needles on hand. It's also a good idea to keep them organized. In this video, I'll share my system for storing my sewing machine needles. I store my sewing machine needles in small magnetic canisters. Each canister is labeled so I know what kind of needle is inside. I'll show you how I did it. The materials needed are readily available. These magnetic spice tins can be purchased at Bed Bath & Beyond or the Container Store. Avery labels number 8293 can be found at your local office supply store. And I use the Avery.com website to design and print the labels. Start by going to the Avery Design and Print section and click Start Designing. Enter 8293 in the search box and select the template. There are hundreds of designs to choose from and each design is fully customizable. Choose your design and you'll be taken to the workspace. You'll be in the edit all mode. This is where you can make the label you want. You can add or subtract elements, edit the text, change the font, and resize the font. When you have the design you want, you can customize individual labels by switching to the Edit 1 mode. Select the position of subsequent labels and add the description of the needles. I included a label for used needles. Click Preview and Print when your design is finished. You can select the individual labels you want printed. Then choose Get PDF to Print and Save if you wish. When you get your PDF, send it to your printer. When the labels are printed, stick them to the tops of the spice tins. The spice tins have now been magically transformed into needle storage tins. Make as many labeled containers as you need. You can slip your used needles into the openings on the tins and keep them there until they can be disposed of safely. If you have IKEA's pegboard system, these tins fit perfectly in the metal shelf. You can tuck them in a drawer or just about anywhere. And these tins make great gifts for your friends who sew. I've given you just a brief overview of my method. So I suggest that you go to the design and print section of Avery.com and play around with it. It's very flexible and you can make just about any label you can imagine for any purpose.
design your labels and have fun.